Hey, what's going on everyone out there on YouTube? What's up, mommies? What's up, poppies? Crazy Gabano here. I'm back again with a new video and a new pickup video. Part one of the I Just Got My Income Tax Return February edition of What You Got More Games. Yes, this video is going to be called I Just Got My Return Tax Return edition of What You Got More Games. Since I picked up so much shit during this month, and I actually have a few things on the way, I'm going to separate this video into two parts. This first part is going to be basically stuff that I got during a little trip that I made this weekend to California, along with Seek Fine Play, and Roll from Seek Fine Play's brother Carlos came along with us, and man, it was an absolute blast. It really, really sucked that we couldn't stay there much longer and we couldn't hang out with some of the guys from California like Air Force Shields, Syphic, RUP78, Shaq Munaki. Uh, unfortunately just due to really strict time you know we weren't able to do a whole lot but for the little amount of time that we had we were able to use it to our full advantage you know, we were able to hit up a swap meet, hit up a couple game stores here and there and we were able to check out Ikea and we were blown away with how big Ikea is. It's absolutely a crazy store. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to find what I was looking for when it comes to the retro setup, which uh, kind of sucks. They had some great stuff, but just nothing I was really looking for or basically nothing that caught my attention. So, other than that, I was able to get a good amount of stuff, so I'm basically going to show you some of the footage that I was able to capture in California, and some footage that I captured today, which is Sunday, February 22nd, 2015. I was able to hit up the Swamp Me. I found a couple of yard sales, but they were all just... And basically showing you everything I got for the weekend, and hope you guys enjoy. So let's see what I did with Seek Find Play in California. Kinda of smells bad in this truck, but uh <laughs> <laughs> We were seek fine play real quick. And a special and guest brother. appearance. <laughs> brother <laughs> Brother <laughs> Seek Fine Play. It's and right. actually, guess what we're doing guys? We're going to go to gas station. They're actually gonna uh <laughs> put me hostage. They want my games, yeah. so they're gonna keep me hostage. But we're actually heading yeah. to California, yay! We're very excited. It's two in the morning. 15. We're tired. Holy shit. Yeah. Yeah. But you right. know what? Let's drop the girl off and go. <laughs> we're, 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 hey, we're about to find out, but we headed to California. Hit up some uh, thrift stores, game some stores, beer. Ikea. <laughs> Try to get a good time going on. So, once he lets me, you know, do the thing, what I'm with him, <laughs> we're going to have a good time. So, uh, we'll see you guys in a bit. What? Is, like, is the baby locks in? What'd you say, Poppy? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we made it right here. <laughs> we made it. <laughs> we made it to, we're, we're in Paramount, Paramount, California. Paramount Pictures presents. The George, Seek Fine Play on their adventure to find Earthbound. Earthbound. So, so we're out here. We hit up a, we're actually outside of Swami right now, so hopefully we can find some good stuff. <laughs> hopefully we can find Earthbound, but I don't know. for him basically, but uh. I'm just here to find some uh, cool stuff. Hopefully they have some nice things we can check out and purchase. We got a good amount of money right here, so let's hope for the best and see what we can find. The button on the screen. guys in a bit. What do you got? Oh, hey guys. What do you got? Hey guys, you know, real quick. But I got some stuff real quick, you know, I was able to... Got that Paul McCartney stuff? I did walk away with some cool stuff for the collection, so... Uh, first two games I got right here are the PSP games. We got Metal Slug Double X, not XXX, we got Double X. <laughs> so no porno, unfortunately, in this game. And we got Castlevania Dracula X Chronicles. I heard a lot of good things about this game. Comes with Rondo of Blood. I believe it's a PC Engine version, so I'm happy to get that. And, you know, you guys know I'm a Pokemon fan, so I had to get these for the collection. I got Pokemon Black and White. Like Michael Jackson said, It doesn't matter if you don't go <laughs> I'm doing that George's wiener. <laughs> Did I really? Yeah. I'll, I'll edit that out. Alright, yeah, so all right. Right. Put that go. Here we go, here we go. What do you got? Right. What do you got? Man, I gotta say, this book off here in Gardena was so much better than the one we went to where the other city? It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. doesn't matter because yeah. it sucked. <laughs> Boy, man, I gotta say, I did get quite a bit of stuff. I wanted to get more, but, you know, I didn't want to spend all the money. 
So I decided to get a couple Famicom games right here. So the first one we got, Super Mario Bros, the original. Nice, so nice. That was, uh, that was the most expensive one, but I mean, it was a fair price. And all these other ones were like five bucks a piece, so that's always a good price. We got Taito Chase Headquarters, which is also, I think, also available for the Turbo Graphics. Well, we also got, oh, look at this, Excite Bike. Ooh. And in Japan, no. it's called Excite the Bike. <laughs> <laughs> no, but, uh, and then this last game right here, Mach Rider. Nice. Mach Rider. So we got those four. Hey, hey, what'd you get? Not a damn he, thing. Oh, damn. Paul McCartney. Oh. Paul, he got Paul McCartney, though. Oh, yeah. And, I mean, this game right have here, <laughs> I have this game for the PS2 already, but for three bucks, how can you pass down a Tekken Tag Tournament? Gold label. Gold label. Come on. Gold I don't know what label. the fuck the difference is, but cool. What Thank does that you. mean? It's ba uh. basically like a greatest hits. You got that. Oh, poppy. And then we got this game right here for five bucks, Nintendo 64, since I've been really getting to uh, collecting for Import 64. Top Gear Rally. Nice. Five bucks. All right. Yay! Yatta! Yatta! Very beautiful mountains here in California. Look at that one. And we're on the freeway right now. We're heading back to Vegas. It's about 2.30 in the afternoon. Yeah. And uh, you can see it. Really nice scenery out here in California. I know. I know Crazy Cabano is pretty uh, beat back there. He, he had a lot of people run up to him because he's famous. No, not really, but <laughs> yeah, I am kind of kind of beat. Ah. <laughs> right, look at the mountains. I don't know. It's just really nice. Mountains, <laughs> son. Oh damn, I hella crashed. Alright, so we just actually <laughs> just left uh, Game World here in uh, Barstow, California. <laughs> Very small city on the way to California. And my oh, man George came up real quick. Oh, I just put the shit away. Man. So I'll let you know what it is and I'll I'll do a video uh, later. Uh, how about I just spill the beans? He, got, he got Kid Icarus for the 3DS. Uh, I just, oh, oh god, I can't even talk Show about it. Show your viewers what uh, I did. Free <laughs> no, let me look, let me look at the mirrors. A up. free Dreamcast <laughs> controller box. Yeah. God damn. Because they didn't know what to do with it. Shout outs to Game World in uh, uh, Death Valley. Yeah. Uh huh. <laughs> wait, 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 Death Valley. Uh, I don't know where we're at. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> where are we at? We're in Barstow, California. We're heading back to Vegas. We actually stopped by a place in Victorville called Eminem Games or something like that. Oh my All right, God. Um, let me tell you guys right off the bat, please. Careful with the guy on the right. If, yeah. oh, this guy's going if our friendship meant anything to you, let me tell you this, do not go to that store. Do not, I mean, don't take it from me, take it from my local fans. <laughs> 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 what, what do you guys have to say about that place in Victorville? When you're selling a don't go there. Box conquers for what? Two seventy five. You got her fucking mind. He's a dirty liar too. Yeah. yeah. He said he sold. He recently sold the loose conquers for one seventy. And this guy had a lot. Yeah, Final Fantasy three box. Super. He had a box. he had a really nice Something selection. Going. I can't Pretty deny much that. He had everything. Yeah. First. Two Chrono Triggers. For some reason he had everything that's good. Yeah, but the thing is, it's probably been sitting there for about the fifteen years that yeah. it's been open. Or seventeen years, he said. Yeah. Yeah. What do you, what'd you think, profit? Carlos? Great selection. Oh, it's too expensive. I know who oh, he yeah. reminded. He reminded yeah, way me too of, expensive. I mean, he, he reminded me of the aliens, aliens guy. <laughs> oh, alien. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So if you ever go to Victorville, or if you ever see a video game store, do not go to it. It's really bad. I mean, the, the guy doesn't take. Ever the, been. Uh, yeah. One of the, not only that. I mean, the guy doesn't take care of his stuff. Like, you, there's stuff all over like the floor and like in the glass cases, just unorganized and just stacked to the top. It, it's really not good. And I'm honestly. I would recommend it. You're just gonna be disappointed, just like how we were. Yeah. So He's basically, fine. shitting on everything. And yeah. I mean, if you are in Barstow, California, yeah, Game World Barstow. is worth checking out. But if you're in Victorville, do not check out that M&M, whatever the fuck it's M &M called. Games or something. You'll know when you walk in because the guy won't greet you. Yeah, he won't <laughs> greet you. He got a dog. Yeah, he got a dog. dog. He'll He'll have the, 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 the dog from Sandlot. Yeah, the, the, <laughs> he has a dog in the in the game store. The dog started whining. And he's just very, places. you know, kind of rude, unprofessional. Just not a store you want to go to. And I'm very thankful we don't have that that crap in Vegas. And I don't know where the fuck I'm going. Yeah. <laughs> See? 
So, Assholes, I told you. Yeah, do not check out Eminem Games. Oh. Worst place ever. So don't right, go there. Play. Don't go there. Bitch, I said don't Maybe. go there. It's all <laughs> desert from here. Peace out, Cali. Peace. All right, so that's some of the stuff I had in California. Like I said, great time. So let's go ahead and show you some of the footage I got from today, Sunday. Hey, what's up, guys? Crazy Gavano again. And it is Sunday, February 22nd, I believe. And 7.30 in the morning, or 7.37. And I'm actually about to hit up some yard sales. And this is the first time in Crazy Gavano history that I've ever recorded myself going to yard sales because I never go due to I have to work on the weekends, you know, which kind of sucks. So I can never have a chance to really hit up these yard sales. And for the most part, a lot of people find some great stuff in the yard sales. So hopefully I can find something. If not, no worries. But, you know, just the thrill of the hunt is cool enough for me. And I found some great stuff yesterday at California with the guys. And yeah, it was a great time. So let's see if I can get some more luck today. Hopefully I can find something. So let's room around the streets of Vegas and let's see what we can find. This some bullshit, dog. I went to four garage sales. Four garage sales. And they were hard to find, too. Believe that. And I didn't find that. <laughs> but, no. Nah, uh, to be honest with you guys, I hit up four so far, and it's all been a no-go. There was only one out of the four that actually had video games. I'm going to look over here, go more northbound, See if I can find at least another yard sale. If not, I'm most likely I'm going to hit up the swap meet. And if I don't find anything there, I'll try to hit up George to see if he wants to go to Retro City Games. Because when it comes to Retro City, you know they're going to have some good stuff. And like what George says, aw yeah. Man, ain't this some fucking shit. Look, I'm over here trying to find a yard sale. They got signs that lead you to nowhere. Fucking bullshit, man. Look at that, nothing. See, there's another example right there that leads you to nowhere. Fucking bullshit! I just got out the car. I'm here at the Swap Me here in Vegas, Broad Acre Swap Me. So. Last hope for the day before I head up to Retro City. So hopefully I can find something good here. Alright, so just got back from the swamp meet. Um, pretty good day. Not too bad. I did pretty good right now. So, here's the bag of stuff I got. A lot of it is Pokemon related. So that's always a good thing. And it was super cheap. Alright guys, so that's all the stuff I got today. So I'm basically going to show you all the stuff I got to, to swap meet because that was the only place that I was able to find some good stuff. Uh, I actually ended up hitting up Retro City Games later, but that was going to be in the next episode. So, oh, someone's breaking in my house! Someone's breaking in my house! Hello? Stranger? Oh, that's just my mom. Never mind. Sorry about that, guys. So, yeah, basically, let me go ahead and show you some of the stuff I got at the swap meet. So, first game I actually picked up was a game that I have never played. I've never played the game that this is the enhancement of basically this is an enhancement of a game that exists on the Dreamcast Sonic Adventure 2 this is Sonic Adventure DX Director's Cup is basically an upgrade to number two I've never played any of those two games but I'm excited to try it out and for 10 bucks I couldn't pass it up and it's in really nice condition so I was able to pick that up got this game originally factory sealed a new game for the 3DS Tetris Axis you know Awesome puzzle game that you know and love, but it has some new um, aspects to it, like some 3D mode. So gives a game a new level of gameplay. So I'm really excited to try that out. And I actually hit up a guy who was selling some stuff, just random stuff. When it comes to the swap means, that's the best vendors you want to go to. Guys who have a little bit of everything. It looks like stuff from their personal, like homes and stuff like that, or maybe it's from storage. Uh, for the most part, that's when you'll get the best deals because you got to avoid those resellers who have nothing but video games because they're always going to ask market prices, which is always sucks. So, 
he had a whole bunch of cases and manuals for DS games and for PSP games and a lot of them are great games but unfortunately there's no game inside it but eh, it's alright it's alright I'll live for now but I'm hoping to find the games uh, for these cases that I needed and these first four cases I'm about to show you you already had the games but I ended up trading the case that I got from the swap meet I ended up giving those to Retro City Games uh, giving it for free just you know just in case they needed it so these games right here are the cases we got a uh, Pokemon white and black I actually got these from my personal collection uh, these are the cases that I had extra then I gave to them and these two as well Pokemon diamond and heart gold again for my personal collection and these are the ones that I actually kept because I don't have the games and I really want them. <laughs> now I need them. So. so, first up, Legend of Zelda Phantom Hourglass, which has the, you know, obviously case and manual. Very immaculate condition. Very nice. We got Soul Silver. I'm really surprised how much this game is going for. Absolutely, oh my God. And, uh, you know, case and manual for that one as well. And Pokemon Pearl. Hopefully, this won't be. As hard as Soul Silver to find. Case and manual for that. So I need the games for these three. If anyone has any extra loose by chance, let me know. Okay, and these last three cases. Great games right here. Um, two of these are actually for a series that I'm actually recently trying to get into because there's some great games for it. And that's the Mega Man series. And we got two games right here Mega Man Powered Up. First one right here. This looks like a really cool game with the anime little kid style to him. The big head. Case and manual. Great condition. Maverick Hunter, Mega Man X. Case and manual. And Sega Genesis Collection. Case and manual. So these were basically two bucks a piece, so about twenty bucks for everything which I'm not going to complain. Um, you know, the guy was kind of set on his price, but I mean, for two bucks, that's an amazing deal, even though they don't have the game, because everything's in very nice shape, manual, paperwork, everything's included, so I couldn't argue with that. So, I'm really happy with that, and hope you guys enjoyed this video. The next video is going to be a lot of stuff. I picked up crazy amount of stuff, and for good prices, too. You know, I can't stress out enough uh, retro city games been taking care of me uh, when it comes to games prices um, very very fair please check them out awesome got some stuff that I got from uh, George from seek vine play got some pretty unique PC items so I'll be showing you that as well got some great stuff from my man Saru Maru great artist here in Vegas he has a website sarumaru.com check him out I got some stuff from him got some pins some artwork and he gave me a free game um, really nice of him and I'm actually going to be doing a review of this game because supposedly it's a very very bad port of a Sega classic so I'll be showing that as well and I'm going to be doing a review on the game so be on the lookout for that review be on the lookout for the second part because if I was to include everything in one video it would have taken me till the end of February just to fucking do the video so until then guys take care hi mom and I'll see you guys next time. Peace. I forgot one more thing before I leave for the night. Big shout out to Seek Fine Play, first of all, for planning the trip. We definitely got to do it again, guys. Check him out. Also want to shout out Eric999. He recently hit 200 subscribers. Recently came across him on YouTube. An awesome, awesome dude. Makes awesome quality videos. Check him out as well. And once again, stay the fuck away from Eminem video games. They fucking suck. But go to Russia City Games. See you guys later.